arrived in Krakow. <laughs> we need to go to our Airbnb and check in and drop off these bags. Looks like our Uber's here. Thank goodness, because otherwise it'd be a 45 minute walk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, off to explore Krakow. Off to explore. <laughs> We're on the right street. Now we're just trying to find the right building. <laughs> and then the right apartment, then we're there. Our Uber driver, we've just realized, dropped us off at the wrong place. <laughs> but thankfully, it's sunny, it's fine. We found the place. It was only a few minutes detour. Yeah. <laughs> we saw some of our neighborhood where we want to go we back We discovered to. that there's a milk bar Oh nearby. yeah, we'll be going back there. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Mark offered to carry my bag. What a nice man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Look at the pool table. Oh my god. <laughs> satisfying. Okay, I feel like I'm gonna finally sit down <laughs> in the old town of Krakow. So cool. Before we actually venture into the real old town of Krakow, I will link this Airbnb down below by the way if you want to check it out. It's pretty, pretty cool. Happy man. <laughs> Got me some brewski pierogies. Sitting here in Krakow. Life does not get much better. No. Now give me the beat. So these are pierogi ruskie with cheese, potato, and onion for $5.80. Yeah, it's less than $2 to me. Yeah. I don't like sharing when it comes to pure libras. Nope. <laughs> In my own way. Me too. <laughs> By the time you leave. Yeah. So good. From starving to stuff. <laughs> From starving to stuff. All right, it's hard to think about food when we've just literally stuffed our bellies full of pierogies, but we <laughs> should probably get some groceries for the next couple days, do you think? Well, I mean, the fridge in our Airbnb was looking woefully empty, and they say you should never grocery shop on an empty stomach, so I think we're safe now that we're really full. <laughs> yeah, that's good planning, And you guys, planning, if you've seen actually. our videos, you know how much we love going to the grocery store in a new country, so we're gonna go pick up some groceries now. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> so this isn't the right door, I guess. I thought it was the entrance. And this man inside was like, 
<laughs> All right. Well, All right. well, here we go. Let's find the real door. <laughs> I know where the fake one is. <laughs> Buns? Some sort of sure. bun? Okay. What are you doing? Which buns should we get? I think we should get the ones down here. Okay. They're delicioso. God, look at the pierogi section. Pierogi Ruskia. This is what we just had at the milk bar. Look at all the different kinds of pierogies. Oh my god. Oh, the candy section. This is one of our favorite milk bars, which I think only comes in this enormous size. Peanut caramel. Oh my god. It's muy bien. Mound sticks. Another classic. And where my Harry Bow at? Where's Harry Bow? Oh. Okay, maybe they only have the bears. Classic. When I was on exchange in Germany, uh, my host mom put these in my lunch every single day. I love them so much. Knoppers. These make me so happy. I think we should get some. <laughs> I've never had one. Maybe we should get some. Okay. I always find this kind of funny. I wanted to show you guys. Whoever's watching in Mexico, here are tortillas, Mexicana. <laughs> and then full-blown cheeseburgers. I don't know how good that would be. And then the funniest for me are these hot dog Americanski, already wrapped. Hmm. Does that look good to you? I don't know. Oh my god, this is also from my German exchange. Milk rice. Have you guys tried this? Oh my god, it's so good. Mark, I think we better get some milk Let's rice. Get a bunch. <laughs> there, these two. There's no yogurt section like a European yogurt no. section. Rice, rice, baby. I want pistachio. Do you like that? Not as much. Chocolate? I'd go chocolate. What about caramel or vanilla? Done. Caramel? Caramel, please. Anything that like a three-year-old would like, please give it to me. Okay. Like a Canadian to make the syrup. <laughs> I wonder if it's actually real. It's still gotten me excited. I know. Makes me crave pancakes like immediately. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, pancakes for breakfast tomorrow? <laughs> Maybe. Mark, I'm doing wheelies with my cart. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Look down to your right. <laughs> Guys, the store is right below our Airbnb. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, and we went in the wrong door. Convenient though. We're back outside, as you can see. The sun has gone down. I'm wearing my puffer jacket for the first time. First use. <laughs> my industrial strength puffer. And um, we wanted to go for a little stroll because we yeah. haven't really been out and about in Krakow yet. And we're crossing this amazing bridge right now mm -hmm. over the Vistula River. Yeah. And we're staying on one side of it. And so we're crossing over towards the old Jewish quarter, which I think is called Kazimierz. I'm glad um, you said it and not me. <laughs> <laughs> That's my best, best try. Yeah. Uh, and then the old town is further. 
so we're just out for a little stroll. And this bridge is amazing. I love it. There's all these locks like on the bottom here, yeah. and these bright lights. And then on the left, it's it's basically like a, an art gallery. It's like Cirque du Soleil over there. Yeah. There's all these acrobatic themed sculptures in various positions, and they're all suspended by the bridge. It's such a cool idea. Yeah, I and love they're that. all nicely lit, and mm -hmm. all this bridge, I didn't even know it was here. So, <laughs> so loving the stroll. So far, favorite bridge in Krakow. <laughs> This area seems awesome. I love the area that we're walking through. Definitely my favorite part of Krakow so far. Yeah. It's so bumping. Yeah, we haven't exactly seen a lot. No, yeah, that's true. All First few hours. <laughs> but there are all these cute little like yeah. cafes and bars and restaurants. I know. And you know when it's like cold outside and you look inside and they have the warm lights on? <laughs> yeah. Candles, everyone's like gathered around tables. Yes. Chatting. I love that. It just feels so warm. Yeah. I love that feeling. Yeah. And we had that for just blocks and blocks and blocks. Yeah. yeah. We just walked through this market and it reminded me so much of a Christmas market. It made me really excited for European Christmas markets. It wasn't a Christmas market, obviously, but it seems like it's a permanent one and there's just all these amazing smells and people cooking things and all these things I wanted to buy. <laughs> me too. Had sticky fingers. <laughs> oh, speaking of which, see what I did there? <laughs> oh wow, that was amazing. We're going. Uh, we're going for dinner now, and the restaurant is called Sticky Fingers. Ah, you, you. We waited for dinner and got a whole night of entertainment, basically. <laughs> we were trying to figure out what to have for dinner. What kind of pizza, because they're known for their pizza at this place. And the, the guy was like, oh, the pizza's a meter long. You can choose four kinds of pizza. <laughs> we're like, excuse me? <laughs> Come again. What, what, what? <laughs> so we got to have four different kinds, which is perfect if you're indecisive like we are and yeah. can't really decide. It was a meter long. I need a wide angle lens for this pizza. This is one meter long. <laughs> I didn't know you could make pizza that It was just so much fun. You need quite a big pizza oven, I would yeah. guess. And the whole theme is music. music. Oh, the bar was made of old radios, which I love how they repurpose those that. things. Well, you love the drums. I love the drum Marcus lamps. The drummer. And I really like the lights that are made of microphones hanging from the ceiling. This has been an awesome day. What a way to end it. Really fun. I hope that you guys enjoyed getting to know Krakow. I can't wait to explore more. Mm. Um, we're gonna dance our way home now, back to our Airbnb, maybe play <laughs> some more pool or something. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. um, and make sure you like the video if you enjoyed it. We hope you did. And to subscribe for lots more travel adventures together. And uh, we're gonna head home and we'll see you in our next video. Bye. Goodbye.